Hello YouTube. So this is MPC editor for Windows XP and uh, probably Vista, but I'm not sure. So here we are making a program for uh, uh, MPC, and uh, after assigning the the sample, you have to save as MPC 3000, and that's all. Here uh, we are making the same things on uh, Mac OS X, so the program change, of course. Remember, even uh, here to save as MPC 3000 and not WAV, but S and D format. Hello again. Okay, here we are. So next step is to use a WAV Studio. Thanks again to Marcus at uh, Wave for the collaboration. So we will open the program we have made with the MPC editor or the other program for Mac OS X. Okay, here we are. So you have the program and here are all the files. You have to choose uh, uh, the program. You can do some modification here. And save as We'll make a new folder, desktop, new folder, S950 uh, folder, okay, S950 folder, folder, okay, we save as dot uh, p and is a uh, chi s1000, so what happened? E I create this new folder and here there is all the program with the file in .s format. Okay, after this, you have to already have installed the Omniflop driver, and uh, this is basically the more important thing. You have to have a floppy driver inside the computer, I mean, uh, connected to the parallel port, not an external USB uh, floppy driver because it doesn't work. I don't know why. However, you have to already install Omniflop driver, and you have to launch, and uh, of course, have installed an application called EMXPN. I'll provide link for everything. This basically manages the MU transfer and the AKS 1000. So it could write AKS 1000 floppy driver. Basically, you have to uh, put all the files in a folder called AKS 1000 inside this program as this okay and you have to rename all this file to from s.s to aks and from for p.p to akp this is uh, quite uh, boring but you can use uh, some uh, program like this like this mm? yes OK, you have to choose the folder, and in this case is here, uh, and here, and find and replace every extension that find start for S to AKS. Huh? Rename, yes. OK, and even for the program you can do manually, because it's only one, of course. Okay. Okay, now we are formatting a floppy here with uh, this program I told you before.
Okay, he's finishing the format. Okay. Now we have to take all the files that we have put in that folder. Okay. And copy to the floppy. He will ask you to confirm every single name. You can uh, uh, say you can enter return every 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 single request because it's all perfect from a wave. And here we go. Okay, it's finished. You can take out the flop. Yes. Now we'll go to test to the Akai. Okay, YouTube, the last part. Loading the floppy. We already assigned the trigger out of the NPC to the Akai. And so let's see if it works. Sorry for the light. Okay, we do a brief check. Okay. 